We're missing some stamps. I don't know where we're missing stamps from. Champion's Road. <laughs> First try. Yeah, that's that was it. First try. Uh, screw you. Uh, all right then. That, that's a thing I have to watch out for. That's a little bit higher than my, a little bit further than my jump goes. There we go. Okay. Ow. That's fine. Screw that noise. Screw you. And screw you. Okay, moving on. Uh, I really don't like these guys. I don't like this broken, uh, this broken highway here. Get out! Just get out! Oh god, okay. Oh god, okay, here we go. Th these just give me endless trouble. I'm so glad I'm Peach right now. No! God! <laughs> I didn't float long enough. Okay, that's fine. Hey, you want to give me a thing? Nope. Why can you assholes not be killed? Okay. Haven't seen a star yet, or anything resembling a star yet. You just... You can. Oh, okay. I know in some Mario games you can just run across things like that. Neat. jumped like too either too early or too late depending on how you feel about it. It's cool, we're gonna get this. It's gonna happen. I believe in me. Rip 90 ever lives. You know, I'll be honest, we only ever had like we we've hovered around 50 lives for a about the entirety of the game. So we probably had like 120 lives throughout the entire game, but for a very long time, we were just at 50. And I've just been steadily losing since then in the final levels. Damn it. Yeah, I haven't played 3D Land, though. 3D World is, uh, my first foray into this nonsense. This may be the level that causes us to game over, and if it does, I'm going to be kind of upset. Because I haven't had a single game over this entire game. Screw that guy. Okay. Nope. <laughs> did not, did not do that right. Like, I had done that 
pretty okay that earlier time, but my timing was very off there. Okay. It's cool. We got 29 lives. We haven't even hit the checkpoint. Okay. That haven't missed that jump before. Threading the needle with these guys. Is Crown World the final world in 3D Land? Ow. That was mildly painful. Okay. That's done. Moving on. I didn't actually jump there. I pressed the jump button, but it became the hover button. Because reasons. Momentum! No! No! No, no, no. Okay, fine. 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 Excuse me. I will beat this with Little Peach. Fine. I was not aware <laughs> that I had made that jump and it threw me off. I thought I'd fallen off. Oh my god. This is just... Oh my god. This level. And we haven't even gotten anywhere. Like, we have not gotten to anything. Like, these are the first sections of this level. Feels bad, man. Okay. No! <laughs> this timing! There's something about this just this block timing that just screws with me endlessly. I just gotta focus on that section because if I screw those jumps up. Okay. We're back here. For the first time in forever. Okay. No! No! Oh! It was so close. We were, we were back there. We had, we had re-arrived. Okay, it's cool. We are learning the stuff that we are able to do here. Like being able to make that jump, for example. We are learning the rules of the level. Hey, got a level up. Or got a one up. Haha, <laughs> level up. Ah. That was really close. Okay. Okay. We're here again.
No, I was on top of the. I'm thinking Toad. I'm thinking Toad. Like, I just, I, I feel like I need more speed. I have a need for speed. That camera angle felt off. Okay, let's let's try. Let's try backing out. Let's be Toad. Welcome back, Ashikiro. We're gonna try the Toad, man. Nope. Okay. That. Nope. <laughs> nope. I, I need. I need the crutch of Princess's float. I need the crutch. I need it. It's necessary. Yeah. Apparently, I've already learned how to do this level with Princess, so I must stay with Princess. That is what I am learning. And with only 22 lives left. I don't have room to argue with that much. Man, remember those days when we had like 50 lives? Those were wonderful days. Oh, I almost didn't make that. That was really close. God damn it. If I could just touch down for a fraction of a second there. Like just fractions of a second. Fractions of a second saves. Fractions of a second save lives. Screw you, Firebro. I'm trying to be a pacifist and not kill these enemies, but they just kind of want to die, apparently. Then again, they are living in this level, so I don't know what to tell you. Okay, that was just... I Apparently, I pressed the jump half a second too late and just floated instead of jumped. Hey, at least I'm getting this first section down, though. I mean, practice makes perfect, right? say things, and then things happen. I don't even know what happened there. Just perfect storm of things. Caused me to just drop in the wrong spot, I guess. Oh, no. For some reason, I wasn't, I wasn't boosted. I don't know what happened. I don't even, I don't, I don't question things anymore. Things happen, I just respond to them. See, now I'm boosted, so now I'm able to keep my speed. For some reason. We're not going to ask questions, we're just going to move on. We are going to beat Champions Road. It is going to happen. I refuse to be beaten by this level. Absolutely not. <sighs> I refuse to be beaten by this level. We will beat this level.
So apparently if you hold down the jump button, that, while you're jumping on top of the enemy's head, that's what gets you the boost. Good to know for the future. I thought you had to jump individually on their heads, like do do it like jump again. But apparently not. It's just holding down the jump button is what does it. Nope. <sighs> it's depressing. Uh, excuse me? Am I gonna do a second playthrough? No. That was more of a joke. The Nye has only just realized a very basic thing about this game, which she was supposed to know decades ago. Okay, okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. No! <laughs> I was there! I was there! I was at the first green star! I just, I just couldn't, I couldn't solidify it. It means I might I might do a second playthrough in the very distant future. Just for giggles, but you know. No time soon. God damn it. It's it feels like a blind jump, it really does. Like, it isn't, but it feels like it is, because the camera's not moving as fast as I want to. Yeah, when I forget about the pain. Yeah, about that. This is a type of pain you don't forget anytime soon. Okay, there we go. I want to play again just to hear this music, though. This music's fantastic. Crap! No! <laughs> ah, no! I wonder how many lives they give you after a game over. Because I'm going to need lives to be able to continue this. But I think the worst game I've ever played was... Um... Good question. I'm actually not sure. Probably some computer game I have in my Steam library. I have actually... I actually have some computer games in my Steam library that I actively turned off because I didn't want to see them anymore. If I if I had held onto float for just a couple more seconds, I would have been fine. That's the thing, I don't usually, like, bring terrible games onto the channel, because I don't want that negativity. Um, and I have a habit of trying to just forget the negative as much as I can. So, I'm not very good at remembering stuff like the worst game I've ever played, just because I try not to remember them.
got you gotta jump from red to blue. You gotta jump from red to blue and back to red. You can't jump from red to red. It's a bad idea. I haven't quite learned this skill yet, but I will eventually. Yeah, I mean I've a uh, I like I get a lot of bundles, and so the bundles come with games I'm not a big fan of. Um, But then, you know, the other thing I gotta be cognizant of is sometimes games are not good because the developers don't know better. And for me, like, a terrible game is a game that the developer should have known better than to make this game or to put out this game and it's, god damn it. Then, or to, then to put out this game in, um, in the condition they put it out in. Uh... That's what really makes a horrible game to me. So, you know, it, it's really hard for me to answer that question because I'd have to think of a game that was not only horrible in design, but also was from a developer that should have known better. Because, you know, I don't want to fault a small developer who, you know, makes a game that's, you know, that's, it's okay, but not good, right? Nope, I'm dead. I was not moving fast enough. That's why I want, that's why I want Toad, but I, I'm using, I'm using the Flutter too much. I spent the entire game with the Flutter. I shouldn't have done that. Now, now I'm addicted to it. Now it's crunch. Like, see, that's the thing. Like, a lot of, you know, a lot of people said, like, stuff like, you know, for example, Call of Duty Advanced Warfare was a terrible game. And I don't agree. I actually liked Advanced Warfare. Now, I didn't play the multiplayer. I just played the single player. But, you know, I thought it was decent. thought it had some cool ideas. I enjoyed the little bit, or, the, or not the little bit. I actually played the entire storyline. But I kind of enjoyed things. So the problem is I tend to look for these things that, you know, god damn it. You know, I don't look for things that are terrible. I look for what are the good things. So I usually find something that's at least okay in all the games that I play. But that also makes it very hard to think of worst games. It's like, well... Maybe two worlds. Like, one of the jokes at work used to be that, you know, I used to always say, like, the Big Mother Truckers was the worst game. But I never played it, so that was, you know, I can't use that as an answer. Because I actually never played that game. But I think uh, Two Worlds probably fits, because it was trying to be the Elder Scrolls killer. And it had no... Oh my god! It had no right to even say anything like that. I just Mass Effect Andromeda is not the worst game ever. Absolutely not. Like, I don't know if I could call it good, and it's definitely not Bioware's best, but I don't know if I could call it the worst game. And, like, that's the thing. The game also, in order to be, like, worst game, it has to be playable. Like, it has to be a game that works, because it's too easy to go, you know... This game had glitches, and therefore, you know, it wasn't playable. Well, then how do you know it's the worst game? Because you couldn't freaking play the game. It needs to be something you can play. I don't think being bland, you know, does it. So there's a lot of games that are just bland, but it's like, you know. Like, I remember playing uh, The Outfit on Xbox 360. It's one of the first 360 games to come out. And it was just bland. It wasn't that it was bad. It was just that there was not a lot to it to, to make it, you know, interesting. I 
I don't know what to do about that jump. You have to really... This is my favorite game this year. That came out this year or that I played this year? And I don't know if that's gonna change anything, but I'm thinking. Like, part of me wants to say Nino Kuni, but I don't know if I can legitimately say that was my favorite game. Because it definitely had some issues, and towards the end of the game, I was getting, you know, a little bit to the point where it's like, okay, we haven't done anything new in a while. Uh, the game is just kind of telling its story. That I played this year? I'd have to actually... I'd have to go look at my playlists and just see what I've played since January. It's like, we're almost into May. That's a significant length of time. God damn it. Like, that's the thing. The thing. One of the things that I enjoy about this game that has really pushed this game up high on my list is every world and almost every level, this game has consistently innovated and added new shit for me to do. You know, it's been, it's, it's had stuff to do. And so I'm constantly being surprised by, you know, maybe new power-ups or, you know, new level design choices like these, you know, slightly separate blocks. This game has consistently added new stuff to screw with me. And so, this game really gets high on my list, but I don't know if I could call it my favorite game of the year. I... I don't even know what I did there. But also, this game's been out for a while, and I knew that this game was out. Like, this ga I knew this game was good before I even touched it. It's one of the reasons why I decided to go after it. I mean, to be fair, I did just beat Zelda this year, like Breath of the Wild, so I could call Breath of the Wild that game. If I, if I had to, you know. Like, I had pray, uh, played Breath of the Wild before this year, but I only just finished it. God damn it. I just needed a second longer on that platform. Oh my god. I've spent 30 lives on this. And we haven't gotten anywhere. Like, that's the thing. We haven't actually gotten anywhere here. Like, if I had got... If I had spent 30 lives, but gotten to the checkpoint... I feel better, but Breath of the Wild is absolutely fantastic. I'm not 100% sure if it's going to be the next game I play, but um, it's going to be on the channel soon. Yeah, we haven't even... I haven't even got the first green star. I've gotten close. Like, part of me wants to play as a different character. Like, you know, maybe Rosalina would be... God damn it! I'm off by, like, a fraction of a second. And those blocks have screwed with me, like, since the game introduced them, so this is not anything new. Like, I'd basically have to relearn how to play the game, though, is the thing. 
Maybe I should go slower? You can't. That's the problem with this section. You cannot go slower. Because there's nowhere to step if you go slower. Okay, there we go. We're back up here. Yes! We got it! We are, we've got the first one! Thank you for bringing the blocks back. Oh, uh, no. no! No, 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 Okay, we got it. Okay, this I can do. This I can do. Oh, my God, no! Oh, oh, my... No, 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 no! <laughs> God damn it. But hey, we got the first green star. Progress has been made. Now, that, now th so the next question is, can I replicate? Can I do it again? That's the big question. That's the important question. Can I do that again? Yeah, you invite a checkpoint now. So I've got to beat the entire level in this one go, right? I need that speed. I need the speed. God, we finally had a game over. 